Right, welcome back to another YouTube channel on my video and in today's video we will be reviewing the fruity pebbles. Gluten free it turns out. I don't know if they've always been gluten free but these ones are. Now, um, I've never tried fruity pebbles before which is why I'm doing this video because um, I've never tried it before and all my friends that live in places where you can get fruity pebbles told me that I can't believe you haven't tried it what are you a fucking idiot and I'm like I guess so because I haven't tried it <laughs> so I actually stumbled across this I was at an art exhibition and then I crossed this place called Easy Mart or something like that apparently it's like some American store uh, grocery store I don't know fucking whatever I found it there okay and I bought it because I was like I can't not try it after being told so much about it. So here I am trying it and I'm going to rank this on a couple things. I don't know how many things until I say it. I'm going to smell the box. If the box smells good, that's a point for me. But for that as well, I guess. If I like how it tastes, that's also a point for it. That's also one pebble, one fruity pebble. Um, if it smells, if it actually smells good, then that's another point for it. If it tastes good with milk, um, that looks good. Um, yeah. <laughs> and finally, uh, uh, I'm gonna rank the art on the box as well. I'll, I made that up just then. And uh, the box art. And I'll continue that as well. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> so, we shall begin with the box art. I think we should do that first. So, I take that back. We should smell it first. That's what you should always do first. So, You gotta get the edges of the box to really gather what it smells like. Alright. I think I got all the sides. Alright, um. <laughs> Alright, first impressions it smells like nothing. Um, it's like cardboard, maybe a bit dusty. Um, so I'll give that about a 10 out of 10 for box smell. Um, so for box art, um, it says Fruity Pebbles on it, so that's, that's good. I know what it is then. It's got uh, Fruity Flintstone and his friend, I can't fucking remember the name of, who knows. Anyway, they've got spoons made of stone out of their hands and they're gonna eat some Fruity Pebbles, so hell yeah, man, that's fucking sick. Um, there's a, a either a mammoth or something else, you know. Uh, there's, whew, there's something there. Um, Fruity Pebbles ice cream, I guess. Uh, oh, they got like a little game here. Oh shit, how do you play it? Try this treat, Fruity Snatosaurus Trunks. That's what it's called. Oh, so you can make it? Yeah. Make your way along the mammoth's trunk maze to the treat. Start, finish. What kind of maze is this? They just, you just gotta do it. Finish and do it. I probably actually did fail it along that somewhere. <laughs> but, you know, 10 out of 10 so far. So now we gotta open the box. Oh, uh, there, there. Yeah, there, there, there. Uh, Hey, but box opening. Um, I don't know if that. I don't know what is in the camera angle. So I'm recording this on my phone, and it's pretty far away, so I can't see. It's also not. The screen isn't facing me, so I can't actually see at all. All right. So now the actual smell. Oh my god, that's a lot of fruity smell. Oh my god, I was not expecting that, man. But what was I to expect if I never smelled it before? I don't know. No, it's very reminiscent of... Okay, so let me explain. I'm a very big fan of Fruit Loops, man. My whole life, Fruit Loops. Oh. And it smells much like that, surprisingly. Um, but maybe even a little more sweet. Oh my god. Oh my god, very fruity, man. Oh shit, I just ruined the first taste. It tastes good, man. But yeah, it's no shit. I was meant to have it with milk. All right, anyway, milk. You know, pour it in. Uh, you know, listen to that. Wow, I poured it in there. Let's get all these in there. Uh, oh shit. Oh shit, it's gone. Can I get that one? Okay. Now I need to pour it in there. You know, so you will go first. Then milk for anyone that doesn't go around. You're insane, and you need to go to hell. Okay. No, you do eat it. Okay, so there it is. I don't know what can be seen on the camera. It's right there. 
there. And now, mmm. Mm. To no one's surprise, it tastes much like Fruit Loops, but even sweeter somehow. Fruit Loops is really good and tastes really sweet and it's refreshing with milk. And with milk, this tastes really sweet and refreshing. You know what I mean? It just tastes good. It just tastes good. The faces you saw on my initial taste was because I don't actually know. I, there's something that happened where I pulled the face for a reason, um, but it. Uh, I don't remember what that was now. It was like two minutes ago. So yeah, that's about my, my attention span. But this is really good though. No, that's what it was. It's because I really like slapped onto it. I made a funny face and I was going to clarify that I don't actually eat like this. So I'm just kind of really excited. But maybe I do eat like this, I don't know. But that's pretty good though. Yeah, so final thoughts. Um, you know, it's pretty good. Uh, it tastes like Fruit Loops, very reminiscent. Um, you know, the box art, great. Smells great. The actual fruity pebbles smells great. The taste is great. It tastes like Fruit Loops, but even sweeter somehow. And it's gluten free, so you know. For all of those people that are gluten intolerant or whatever it is, you know, you can have some if you haven't had it before. And if by some chance someone lands in this video and they haven't had it and they're looking for an actual, you know, intelligible and knowledgeable review on it, probably shouldn't have come to this video. Um, sorry about that. But just know that it is good. It is very good. Um, <laughs> yeah, so hopefully someone enjoyed that and someone got a good something out of that. Maybe this really was fulfilling in your day and this made you laugh or something and uh, did something for you. I don't know what anyone would have gotten out of this video, but maybe something. Um, but yeah, uh, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs> what the fuck?